Can we get used to the fact that I'm never gonna be ready for no freaking intro? Anyway. Hello ladies, welcome back to my channel. Um, can we get used to the fact that I'm never gonna be ready for no freaking intro? So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing the Q&A. Um, I was just getting ready, um, and then I dashed myself some food. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do the Q&A while I eat. Um, I posted a YOLO a few days ago asking you guys to ask me questions, and I got a lot of questions, to be honest. So let's get to that while I eat. I got myself some vicino. I got myself a panini from sandwich with, um... Some salad. Look how freaking dank this looks. <laughs> Sheesh. Period. Okay, so I wrote them down on a piece of paper because I have the questions on my phone and I record on my phone. So, so the first question is, how old are you? And I am, I just turned 20 last month. Um, so yeah, I'm 20, ready to be 21. Just kidding. Bro, like, I've been craving this sandwich forever. This shit bussin' bussin'. Okay, so yeah, the first one was, how old are you? I am 20. Next question, any siblings? I actually do. Hold on, let me put my, my cervecita. Ah, just kidding, it's apple juice. I have four siblings. Two twin sisters, which are 15, and a little sister that's two, and a little brother that's eight. My two-year-old sister and my eight-year-old brother are just my dad's kids, and then me and my twin sisters um, were from my mom and dad. So, yeah, I'm the oldest out of all of them, to be honest, so I'm like the mom, and honestly, I love my siblings very freaking much. I mean, I fight with them, and they piss me off, and they're annoying sometimes, but I freaking love them. I actually got um this tattoo because of them. So, like, this is Marina, Marily, Cesar, and Kayla. Those are my siblings' names. But, yeah, that's why I got that tattoo because of them, and since I'm the oldest one, like, you know. Next question. What made you decide to start a channel? The reason I decided to start a channel, and I think I said this in my first video, If you are new to my channel and you have not seen my first video, um, it will be linked down below. Um, so you guys could watch it. <laughs> um, but what made me decide to start YouTube was the fact that I think my life is so interesting, apparently. And I post it on Snapchat. Like, I post... If you guys have me on Snapchat, you know I post my whole life on there. Like, ever since I was young, like, when I was, like, 15, 16, I would always, like record and pretend i was doing a morning routine or like stuff like that i started getting the confidence just last year i did it like i made a whole ass video it was my first video and i edited and everything it would like a couple days thinking if i should post it or not so that's why i decided to start um doing youtube because was i would see it as a like i would see it since i was younger and i would like it and stuff so i was like might as well give it a try and now i'm here Sitting in front of my window, talking to my to a camera, all stupid. But whatever. Next question is, if I want kids in the future. What? What? Oh, okay, so it's you want kids in the future. And también otra que decía, ¿Quieres hijos or is it fuck them kids? And for right now, honestly, it's fuck them kids because I feel like I'm still young and I'm not stable enough to have a child but if i was stable enough i would have a child because i love kids so i do want kids in the future of course with someone who who's down to like raise a family with me have a family with me because i don't want my kid to grow up in two separated families because i grew up in two separated families and that is not the move so i would want to be a whole family no i want that pero pues si no se puede Sería una mamá luchona chingona, period. Ah, just kidding, but 
Yeah, I would like kids. I honestly love children a lot. So I do want kids in the future. Hopefully, I'm able to have kids. If I don't, yo sí voy a llorar todos los días en mi vida. <laughs> okay, and then the next question is dream job. Dream job. So for my dream job, if I had the intelligence, the money, and the patience to get to my dream job, it would be to be a radiologist. And if you guys don't know what a radiologist is, it's um the person that does the x-rays and shit. I also wanted to be um an ultrasound technician. Um, But yeah, radiologist would be my dream job, honestly. Damn, I needed this. I needed food, bro. Okay. Favorite food. <laughs> so, it's Frito pie, green enchiladas, y tostadas de ceviche. And wings. Those are my four favorite things to eat. Who looks more like your mom from your sisters? Because I don't look like my mom. I look like my dad. I mean, some people say I look like my mom, but I honestly feel like I look like my dad. And then my little sister, for my little sisters, the one that looks more like my mom is Marina. If you guys don't know who Marina is, Marina is one of my little sisters. Um, I made a video with her a while back. That will also be linked down below if you guys haven't seen that video. So you guys can meet my sister Marina. But yeah, Marina is the one that they say, and I think she looks more like my mom as well. I mean, they're twins, but they don't look like identical, you know? Plans for the future. Honestly, my plan is to go to college, and I've been saying this since I graduated, but I actually want to go to college, but I want to move out of New Mexico and go to college out of New Mexico. And the goal is to move to San Antonio, Texas. That is my fucking dream. But we'll see what happens. So someone asked, are you ready for bailes in New Mexico? And honestly, I'm ready for bailes in New Mexico, Texas, Colorado, wherever. I just want to go dance, have fun. Oh my gosh, how exciting. I want to travel a lot. I want to get out of New Mexico and meet different places. And I want to meet the... Quiero ir a las playas en Mexico. That is the goal for this year, to go to a playa in Mexico. Because fuck. I haven't been working on my summer body, but I don't care. <laughs> I just want to go to La Playa. Who inspired you to do YouTube? <coughs> um, because when I was younger, I would always see, like I said, I wanted to start YouTube sin since I was like 15, 16. And I would see um these YouTubers. I don't even, I haven't seen them recently, but they were... They were young YouTubers, too, and I would, like, get inspiration from them. But I do have a few, um, like, favorite YouTubers that I get ideas from. So, like, I have three favorite YouTubers, and that would have to be Les, Alondra, and Louis. Biggest pet peeve. Are y'all even ready for this one? Y'all want to know my biggest pet peeve. My biggest, biggest pet peeve is when someone t is not on time or takes forever. That is my biggest pet peeve because I'm a person that's always on time. And literally, I'm always ready on time. I'm always where I gotta be on time. Like, so me da, like, oh, my biggest pet peeve is when people take forever, bro. Like, I have no patience for that. But. I have like a few lovely friends that love to picarse la cola to get ready and shit. <clears throat> so I learned to be a little bit patient now because post mimo, I gotta deal with them. They're my friends. Uh, like sometimes I just wanna, but we know we won't fight. I'll be there con mi carota waiting for them to get ready, but I won't say shit. <laughs> but yeah, that's my biggest pet peeve, honestly. Um. My biggest goal, my biggest goal, this might sound a little um, stupid, but it's not like something material, you know what I mean? 
My biggest goal is to become a more peaceful person. I feel like I'm becoming a different person now that I'm growing up. Like I'm getting to learn more about myself, like stuff that I didn't even know. And my biggest goal is to like really like completely find myself and learn about myself. You know, that's my biggest goal. I want to be a better person because honestly, like getting a house. Yes, that's a big goal, but that's a goal that anyone can accomplish, to be honest. And it's money wise. Inside of you is what's most important than like las cosas materiales that you could work for like and get like that. You know, like a goal should be something that is hard, like really, really hard to get. Learning about yourself and loving yourself and getting to the point that you could help others to find themselves. That's like, that's something that I will feel happy to walk around feeling the way I feel, you know? So that's a big goal. And I know it's hard because a lot of people struggle to like find what they like or even they have they struggle to love themselves you know but yeah that's just i'm getting out of topic but that's one of my biggest goals to be honest um next so a question was favorite gym and honestly i only went to the gym last year at the the end of last year no in 2019, I started going to the gym in 2019 and then a little bit of 2020 and then I stopped going. And I only went to Planet Fitness. And honestly, I don't think I have a favorite gym. I only went to Planet. I went to Defined Ones with a friend. Um, And I mean, because a gym's a gym. They all have equipment. Okay, you can work out and shit. There shouldn't be a problem with a gym, I guess. <laughs> Insecurities. I have no insecurities i'm perfect i just kidding fuck that okay so my biggest biggest insecurity is my freaking nose that is my freaking my freaking insecurity and one of my goals is to fucking get a nose job my biggest goal is to get it next by next year so let's see what happens but yeah that's my biggest insecurity my nose and then my ears and my hands like Pretty much that's it. Like my body, yeah, I'm insecure in my body, but only sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, ah, she's all right, deal with it. But but sometimes I'm like, damn, like my body could be better. Like I could have more caderas, more nalgas, more a flatter stomach. But then sometimes I'm like, whatever, bitch, deal with it. But it depends. But yeah, um, those are um some other questions that you guys asked i would have wrote wrote in written i have i would have written more down but then this video was gonna take years y eso no queremos because then aquí vamos a estar aburridas forever like always if you guys did stay till the end thank you guys so much for watching Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for the next videos.